Welcome to Learn Chinese with Ying Ying. This is our fourth lesson of the series Learn Chinese Characters with Pictures and Stories. Hua Shuo Zhong Wen. Today we are going to learn top five characters of animals that is Niu, Yang, Ma, Chong, Yu. In just five minutes, you will be able to read and write these five characters. There are also tests for you to check your own learning. You will be surprised and impressed by your own progress. The first word we are going to learn is new. New, it means ox. But before we look at the character, let's look at the picture first. Dig into the origin of the word. So when you look at the character, everything will make sense to you. Well, imagine yourself living in the age thousands of years ago. How would you carve it on the stone? I highly recommend you or sketch it on the paper or even imagine it in your mind. You will have a way much longer retention than just listen to me. Well, let's look at how people did it thousands of years ago, the Oracle Bone Script. Does it look like yours? I suppose so, more or less, isn't it? And then this is uh, the simplified Chinese. It is pronounced as the new, new. It means ox. Let's see how it evolved into this one. See, this is uh, the left horn, and then the rest part become a straight line. And you see here is the ear of uh, the ox, and this one is also simplified into a straight line. And this one is a whole face, doesn't change. So if we look closer, we can see the strong connection, don't we? Well, now let's write the word together. Do you remember our rule of writing? That is from left to right, from top to bottom. Here we go. First stroke is uh, a short left swing. And... Uh, a horizontal line and the second horizontal line is a little bit longer than the first one and then in the middle a vertical line here we have it the word new new it means ox let's look at the second word that is yang yang it means goat Look at this picture. How would you sketch it? Well, this is quite a truthful sketch of the goat, isn't it? And here is our simplified Chinese. Yang, yang, it means goat. You know, let's see the evolution of it. This is uh, the horn, two horns of uh, the goat. And uh, the eye, the nose. The mouth, three lines, symbolized for this uh, three part. And the whole face become a straight line. So this is uh, how the word evolved into the simplified one. From the top, the first stroke is uh, a dot, another dot. A straight line the second one a little bit shorter and the third one is the longest one and then the vertical line here we have it the word yang yang it means the goat the third word we are going to learn is uh, ma Ma, it means horse. How would you sketch it? I know it's a little bit tricky, this one, isn't it? But I believe you can do it. Well, if you are done, let's look at the Oracle Bone Script. 
This is quite a truthful sketch of the picture, isn't it? And here is the simplified Chinese. It is pronounced as ma, ma. It means horse. So look at these two characters. You can see the shape doesn't change a lot, but the simplified Chinese just simpler, right? And the square and the straight and the neat. And let's see how the word evolved into the simplified Chinese. See here is the head of it. And here is the body of it. Hello. And here is its leg. So can you see the strong connection now? Okay, now let's write the word together. So the first is a straight line and with a sharp turn into vertical line. And here, from here, a vertical line, sharp turn into a horizontal line, another sharp turn into vertical line with a hook, and then a long line. Here we have it, the word ma, ma, it means horse. The fourth word we are going to learn is chong, chong, it means insect. Well, look at this cute picture, how would you sketch it? And now let's look at the Oracle Bone script. Well, this is a... I feel it's quite a truthful sketch of it. You know, the head and the body, the eyes. And here is our simplified Chinese. It is pronounced as chong, chong. It means insect. Let's see how the word, these two connected. Do you see the head here? You know, the head just become a rectangle. And the body become a straight line and also the tail of it, right? So can you see the strong connection now? Well, now let's write the word together. So the first one actually is just to write a, a rectangle. The first stroke is a line, a vertical line, a little bit longer and a sharp turn into a vertical line and close it up with the of horizontal line and a long vertical line in the middle and uh, it's a line with a little bit of slant and a long dot here we have it the word chong chong it means insect the last word we are going to learn is yu Yu, it means fish. Well, how would you sketch this cute one? If you are done, let's look at the Oracle Bone script. Well, I believe this is quite a truthful sketch of the fish. What do you think? And then this is our simplified Chinese. It is pronounced as yu, yu, it means fish. I believe you can see the strong connection between these two. Okay, let's see how. This is the head of the fish. And uh, the body is a square. Can you see it? It simplifies into a square. And all the bones inside are simplified into a cross. The tail is simplified into a horizontal line. So can you see the strong connection now? Well, let's write it together from top to bottom. The first stroke is a, a left swing, short one, and a short line with a sharp turn into a slant to left. And a, vertical line horizontal line quite 
the same length and a sharp turn into a vertical line and a, a horizontal line, vertical line, and a horizontal line to close it up. And the last one is a long horizontal line. Here we have it, the word yu, yu, it means fish. If you want to check your own learning, please click the video in the end of this lesson or the link in the description box. I hope this lesson was helpful. There are more lessons coming in this series. I'll upload the video resources weekly. Please be sure to hit the subscribe button so you won't miss a thing. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you next time. 谢谢观看，我们下次再见。